Hello and welcome to our instructional series of videos. In this installment, we're going to show you how to upgrade the memory in a 2019 Mac Pro. We've already gathered our materials, shut down and unplugged the Mac Pro, and are working on a soft static-free work surface. We're now ready to begin. To open the Mac Pro, first unlock the cover by lifting the handle at the top of the Mac Pro and turning it a quarter turn counterclockwise. You can then lift the outer casing up and off the Mac Pro. To remove each of the memory covers, first pull out on its locking tab, slide the cover over slightly, then pull it straight out. To remove the existing modules, push out on the tabs on the edges of the memory module slot to unlock it, then slide the module the rest of the way out. If you're installing modules of all the same size, use the guide on the back of the memory cover to determine which slots to install the modules in. If you're installing memory modules with different capacities, such as two pairs of 16 gig modules and a pair of 8 gig modules, you'll want to use the same guide as before, but you'll need to install your DIMMs in pairs from largest to smallest capacity in order of the memory channels, which is 5 and 8, 3 and 10, 1 and 12, 6 and 7, 4 and 9, and finally 2 and 11. Please note that if you're installing 8 modules, you'll want to skip the 1 and 12 pairing. Before installing the module, make sure the tabs on the slot are in the open position. There's a notch on the memory module that corresponds with a pin in the memory slot. Line the two up and slide the memory module into its slot until the side latches snap close completely. Repeat the process for the remaining modules. On each of the memory covers, there's a small notch on one of the sides. Place the cover over the module so that the unnotched end is facing towards the front of the Mac Pro, then swing the cover into place so that it latches. Repeat the process for the other cover. We're now ready to close up. Make sure the cover is oriented properly, then slide it back down over the top of the Mac Pro. Finally, turn the handle a quarter turn clockwise to lock the case shut and lay the handle flat. If you have more than 128 gigabytes of memory installed, you may notice that after powering on the Mac Pro, the screen may remain blank for a longer time than usual while the Mac Pro addresses all the memory available. This is normal and shouldn't be a cause for alarm. 